What are your thoughts on people choosing between their career versus their happiness? Um. I want you to try something for me. I want you to try and imagine a world without money. A world without the stress and struggle of owing debt or having to find a job. In our society, we are trained to think that the world revolves around money. With a population of over 8.3 million people, New York City is one of the most prominent cities in the world, and it is known to be the city of opportunity. People all around the world come here to find a job. But why do we work? We went out to investigate. Why do you work? Well, I work so I can pay off my student loans and pay my rent and I use my money for fun too, so I can have fun. I work because I absolutely love my job. That's why I work. I work for myself. For the for myself. <laughs> um work to make money. In order to get money. To get money. I work to have money. Uh, I work because I need the money to do what I actually really want to do. Yeah, so that's how it is for most people. Basically to spend on things you need. New York City is too expensive. If you can imagine a world with no money, what would you spend your time doing? Um, if no money, I would probably see the world. Because, you know, be free. <laughs> If, if there was no money in the world and it was like that, then we'd probably, a lot more people would get along, it'd be a lot different, and we wouldn't have half the issues we have, and people would be more communal, and there'd be more of a human connection for everyone. I think I, think I would be more um, creative and more expressive, and um, I would, yeah, I would definitely be happier. Absolutely. But I'd definitely be more artistic, you know, in general, I think. I mean, it would create more happiness in the world since money doesn't really buy happiness, as you say. So it would probably be very stable, not too bad. Though. I'd probably still do what I'm doing, work. I like what I do, so just continue doing all that. Yeah, if money weren't an issue, uh, I would... I would live in a cottage in England and I would write books. I would just write for my entire life. I would just write books. Yeah. I dreamt of becoming an architect. Uh, it is probably an astronaut, but uh, I think now I want to be a marine biologist. Uh, I want to be a you know professional skateboarder, classic. Too many people skateboard, so that went out the window. <laughs> <laughs> When I was young, I wanted to be Indiana Jones. I wanted to be the first woman Indiana Jones because I was really big into Egyptology and archaeology. So I was like, I want to do Indiana Jones. I want to find stuff. I want to go on adventures. And then my brother was like, you know, you're going to be most of the time in a library reading books. And I was like, and then I was like, oh, I could just pretend that I'm a Indiana Jones in a movie. That works out. I honestly planned on owning my own company. And, you know, doing like a lot of businesses. And that's basically it. I dreamed of doing modeling and stuff since it was always recommended to me since I was younger. So. Uh, daytime soap actor. I actually thought I would be, for some reason, I thought I would be like a therapist or a psychologist. Do you love your job? No, I'm a bus boy, so, uh, no, not really, but I like it a lot. Um, I like the, the perks that my job gives me, but the Be actual honest. job itself, I, I hate it. Yeah, thank you. But the perks <laughs> that I get from my job is what makes what me stay. I'm, I'm, I'm a flight attendant with a major airline, so. I mean, if I had my dream job, I would definitely love it, but right now I'm just, trying to gain experience and things like that. So. I absolutely love my job. I have the best job in the world. I love doing it. What do you do? I'm an American Sign Language interpreter. So. Um, if you love 
lost your job tomorrow, what would you do? Look for a new one. I'd probably do it. Just go look for a new stuff. Well, I, honestly, I'm I'm 16. Like I've got my parents to support me, but I would. I, there's jobs all over our town, and um, I've had a couple at different restaurants. So I would probably just go find another one. Well, she did this a new job. Um, at first it feels liberating, cause then it's like I have free time. I don't have obligations. But as an adult, you realize I have bills to pay. I'd try to find another one. I would panic. That would be the first thing I would do if I lost my job tomorrow. I would panic. I would. I would probably um, cry, and then. Then you'd be happy. You complain about your job all the time. I do, but you I would. But I would, I would cry because I because I like my money that I make. <laughs> so I would be upset about that. But then I, you know what? I would immediately. I'd like the next day. I'd be looking for a new job immediately. I wouldn't even hesitate. Yeah. Great that's over me